get no rest No, no I've been down so long That my mind can't get no rest No, no This ain't easy, darling Cause the devil was on my trail Been running so long that my feet don't work no more.
see here, I want to just do a bit of talking about what I've been doing. So we always prep the lawn first by getting the grass nice and short. That is why I've gone round the edges just to neaten them up with the strimmer. And I went round with the mower just to cut it all and scalp it basically. And then because it is stony soil on a new build estate, um, I wanted to get the stones out from where I could round the edges. This is my wolf garden hand scarifying rake. I'm going around the edges because the scarifying machine doesn't actually fit in that location uh, because of the wheels and where the blades are. So we scarify around the edge. And then we're using the Holotine aerator to punch some holes in that relieves compaction and allows aerating and nutrients to drain through. And then here we now have the scarifier which is my Viking two, uh, 540 scarifier and that is just trying to rip out any thatch and moss and dead matter from within the ground. The next thing I'm doing here is raking up all that dead matter, all the material and raking it into piles and then popping it into the customer's bin. Now we've got one final mow and this final mow just picks up any remaining bits of debris but they're in the ground Get everything tidied away into the van because there's nothing worse than having to do it right at the end. Now we've got overseeding. Now I've done the pre-seed fertilizer and I'm using the overseeder here, which is my drop spreader. And now we're going over with a compost spreader. Now you don't need to use one of these. You can actually just put it on by hand and use a brush to rake it around. But these are quite handy tools. And that is pretty much it in a nutshell. We've got to make sure that the compost is worked in and not smothering any existing grasses. So I'm using the lawn levelling loot. And then the final thing to do is to use the roller just to firm it all in. And then last thing, I run over and, and give it a spray with my emerald green, which helps the seeds to germinate. Any questions, comments, please leave them down below. And thanks once again. Catch you again.